This video is presented by the EA Creator Network. Big shout out to them for letting me capture early Madden 23 footage for you guys. Quick disclaimer, everything you are about to view is a work in progress. What's going on guys? Today we're gonna to be playing our first Madden 23 game. Disclaimer, I did play a lot of the beta, so I do know a little bit about this Madden 23, but um, honestly, it isn't really too similar to the beta, the version that I'm playing right now. And obviously the version you're seeing right now is gonna be the day one, or day zero, I guess you could say launch. And obviously some things are a work in progress, so keep that in mind. The person we're about to play is K-Mac. You guys are very familiar with him. Um, he's a great player. He actually took really good strides last couple years, coming to a competitive and content creator. And he's doing it really well. He, he's a CFM goon. He runs these CFMs. He posts a lot of them. And, you know, uh, he's had a lot of success with that type of quality content. And, you know, we're going to be playing him. I feel like we do this every year. Last year we played um, in the Game Changers program. This year we're going to do it again. And yeah, so he's gonna be matching the bills to my, I mean, I'm not too sure who I wanna use right now. Obviously I could, you know, go with the Packers Packers route, but I kinda wanna have some variants, of course, right? So we're gonna go with the Chiefs. I know they're a little too OP and you know, they are like, you know, a cheesy team. They have that conception that, you know, you just throw streaks with them. You play toxic if you use the Chiefs, but they're honestly not that crazy this year. They do still have McCole Hardman, but I'll try to show you the roster here in a second. All right, guys, so um, for offense, I think I'm going to be trying the new Las Vegas Josh McDaniels playbook um, and show you guys kind of like what's in that. For defense, I guess go 4-6. I'm not too familiar with the defensive playbooks. I am somewhat familiar with the offensive playbook, so if you guys have any questions, comment them down below. Of course, we're going to go throw it deep with this, the, the Chiefs, and then I guess we could defend deep pass as well. So obviously this Chiefs team lost Tyreek Hill, but we do have MVS. So, you know, they're not as fast anymore, but I still like MVS. He's a tall target. He's at 93 speed this year. This is a rematch of the playoffs. Let's get into it. So he's going to take the ball out right here, guys. And remember, this is a live comm. If I mess up, forgive me on that. If you guys were curious about the abilities, I'll show you them here in a second. For K-Mac, he's going to have digs with Jukebox, Deep and Elite, Grab and Go. He's going to pick artist and Acro on uh, Tredavious White with that deep out zone KO. Vaughn Miller, new addition to the Bills, Edge Threat, Adrenaline Rush, No Outsiders. Josh Allen, who is really good. Uh, fast Break, Pass the Elite, Dashing Deadeye. Micah Hyde, Pick Artist, Medium Route KO and deep out zone KO, mid zone KO for Jordan Poyer. For me, I only got three abilities, but you know, I, I feel like I'll be able to ball. We're gonna use uh, dashing Deadeye, red zone Deadeye, no look Deadeye, pass the elite with Mahomes, Tad and Apprentice, leapfrog, deep out elite with Kelsey, and Chris Jones with El Toro, goal line stuff, and under pressure. The big thing is, now Mahomes has pass lead elite. This Chiefs defense, you know, it's, for the past couple years, hasn't been that good. Uh, honestly, pretty bad if you if you ask me. But they've made some improvements this year. I mean, the D line isn't the best. I mean, we have Chris Jones and Frank Clark, but we're going to be using newly added newly added Justin Reed, uh, Dwan Thornhill. I believe Fenton is fast. The new rookie got to put him in real quick. Where is he at? McDuffie, and then obviously Snead at 94 speed. Um, this defense definitely had some work over the years, and it's it's slightly better. You know, it's not the best. But, you know, it's very viable and workable. See right here, we're in nickel normal. We're screaming first play. And we get a nice disengaged sack. I don't even know that, if that was a disengage. I think that was a free runner. He did have the corner route open. But Josh Allen, I thought he had a good release. Um, I'm going to make a QB release videos, uh, regs teams ranking videos, all that coming soon. I thought he had a good release. I played like, you know, a little bit in practice mode. And, you know, it's not that good. It's not as good as I thought it was. I should say that. You know, he's pretty good on you know deep passes but when it comes to intermediate passes he definitely has a not so good wind up and you know you'll see it throughout this video right now i'm running this uh nickel normal and of course i have auto flip off gonna have to waste one right here once more uh, we're in this match coverage type of look i'm honestly probably gonna send three right here and see if we could get any types of pressure and we are gonna get crazy amounts of pressure with chris jones and this is a fourth and 18 I assume he's going to punt it, but you never know. I mean, we'll see right now what he's going to do. And he's going to go for it. You know what this means. We're going to put the 30s on. Uh, we're going to put the 10s on. And we are going to send the dogs. 100% got to send the dogs right here. I mean, it's mandatory at this point. And hopefully I get home free. He's going to throw that right at Justin Reed. And if you guys know K-Mac, you know how much he loves Justin Reed. I mean, Justin Reed on the Chiefs is a good addition. I can't wait to see him ball out for the Chiefs. I'm obviously a Raiders fan. Hopefully he doesn't do anything against the Raiders. But man, that was that was nice. I li I'm liking the way this defense is playing so far. 
Um, you know, this is the Chiefs defense. They just kind of, they just got a four and out plus a pick six. They're balling out right now. I'm usually going to have these videos uh, somewhat shorter, but since this is like my first game of Madden 23, I really want to make it prolonged and try to break down as much as I can for you guys. None of us had this product yet, and I want, really want to break down this stuff for you guys because there's a lot of info that I even myself need to figure out. And hopefully we could do that together throughout the year um, once more in this nickel normal. Descending four right now, little Mabel look on the right. He's going to go for this crosser play, and he does have it. Good read. I'm not even mad at it. Uh, Justin Reed is going crazy on that side. If he had an ability like a KO, that's 100% a knockout. I have noticed at the 30s, you know, you could throw over them here and there. But, uh, you know, that, that did take a long time for it to develop. I'm not really, you know, pressing on the matter. As long as he's, you know, has to make a proper read and, you know, my pressure is getting there. I am sending four every rip. See right here, he's going to have that curl route. Great read to Dawson Knox. Definitely going to mix it up here in a second, run a little match, and see what I could do with that. Probably going to run man right here. Hopefully it doesn't... Okay. It, it gave away that I'm in man, but it's fine. Um, you know, I'm not too worried about that. Hopefully we can play a little bit of uh, defense right here. He is going to have absolutely no one. He's going to take a brutal sack. Chris Jones with two sacks already. This dude is going crazy. He's going to have that in route, but you know, okay, that's going to suck. At least he doesn't get as many yards as he could have right there. He kind of got put in a bad animation. I'm not complaining. That was a cornerback against, you know, Dawson Knox. Big body. As, as long as we make these tackles, I'm, you know, I'm completely fine with it. Right here, we are going to try to adjust. Okay, he's going to motion him out right here. I like this play call by him. Um, he used to do, always do this to me last year. And good dot. I thought I had a purple out there. I guess the DN purple isn't going to get out there. Um, I definitely should have sent the he as soon as he sent the running back out and he's going for two very curious call It seems like that. He you know, it seems like this is some Madden 22 uh, Shenanigans going on right here. I do not like that whatsoever Good bag terrible user It's all good though. We're time to play a little bit of offense So like I said in the pregame lobby Raiders playbook It's not the same and I did a am gonna do a playbook video whether or not it's out already or not I'm not too sure. I've recorded a bunch of things already so whenever you're seeing this, uh, just know I have a playbook video out rating the top five playbooks. If you'd like to go watch that, go back and check my uh, channel out. But, you know, this is Raiders playbook. We have U-Trips now. We have uh, Trips tight end. We have Bunch. But instead of, you know, having the Patriots Bunch, we have Bunch Trail. So this is very similar to Raiders playbook, obviously. But, uh, excuse me, this is very similar to Patriots playbook, except a few things are different, such as that bunch trail play. I want to take a delay, but I mean, it's whatever, you know, I, I just really want to play. He's in 2 4 5 odd. We're just going to run the ball and get to a hash. I played K-Max so much this uh, last, you know, latter half of the year, and he was he was really good in this 2 4 5 odd. I was having a lot of issues. All right, we got Josh Gordon in the game. We got McCole Hardman. We got MVS. We got, I want to put Ronald Jones in. I think he's the fastest back. And then we got Travis Kelsey. Um, you know, definitely going to be audibling around a lot. Just giving him the type of looks. This is a Raiders tour, if you were wondering. Um, there are definitely, definitely better playbooks in the game. But for the time being, you know, I'm not too mad about this playbook. Just want to run new things, of course. We might have Hardman going down the left sideline, and we don't. And thank God he didn't pick that off. I wanted to just chuck it deep to McCole Hardman, but, you know, I don't know. That did not look open, if you ask me. Um... He had a guy kind of guarding it. I, I thought for sure due to the fact that he was like in a baseline press look that I would have something deep, but you know, that just wasn't the case. Like I was saying earlier, Mahomes has a new release and you know, it isn't the best on short passes. See right there, you could judge for yourself. It was like, all right, I guess. But on deep passes, it definitely is pretty effective and on the run too. I mean, that's very realistic to how Mahomes plays in real life, of course. I'm loving this play right here. I have McCole Hardman on it as well. If I have enough time, this might be a nice, I don't know about a one play touchdown, but we might have something. Let's just say that. We might have something. See right here, we don't get any types of times. Guy was wide open. I'll keep that in my back pocket, you know, maybe block someone, but because he's just sending everyone every play, you know. Eventually, uh, you know, we're gonna make adjustments to that. We are gonna take off with Mahomes, get a good amount of yards, and he ran match right there. Actually had nothing open, if you ask me. I'm definitely gonna have to mix it up a little bit, run some other type of plays, because he's he's always gonna play good defense in that two, four, five odd. Um, and especially with the plays that I have, he's just so used to like everything I know and run. See right here, we are in U trips. And hopefully I could get something cooking. Two, four, five odd. We're gonna hit this uh angle route, excuse me, not angle route, zig route. And I think this is what, a fourth and three at this point. Fourth and two. Something like this, you know, I don't like this play too much. 
But if we do have something, we're going to hit this read. Good read to Travis Kelsey. We'll take that, get our first down, keep the chains moving. Right here, just a little bit of motion from uh, U-Trips. We all know and love that uh, motion out of U-Trips. Right here, look at Travis Kelsey going crazy. Another one, another one. We actually end up taking a big hit stick. Thankfully, we didn't fumble. Um, but man, Travis Kelsey and those big tight ends are going to be very effective this year. Air trucking does seem like it's back, not to the extent where it glitches people out, more to the extent that, you know, it's going to break tackles for you. So those big tight ends are definitely the move. As you see right here, we get put in a tackle battle. We actually lose it. The type of shell he's been running, it looks like he's going to be in a cover too. So hopefully we are able to attack either the sideline on this play or the seam. And I do have a nice high ball uh, threat in Travis Kelsey. We'll just see what he looks like he's in. It looks like he's uh, motioning that guy out. Hopefully we have a little bit of time. And I'm going for Travis Kelsey or Josh Gordon on this play. One or the other. And we are going to have Josh Gordon. Beautiful play design. I thought for sure he'd be in cover too. I don't know what that was. That was match. Okay, makes sense. You know, sometimes match, he just it just does whatever it wants. Yeah, that was just a beautiful play. Josh Gordon, new to the Kansas City Chiefs, gets a touchdown for us. First offensive touchdown of the game. And yeah, that was kind of a struggle drive. I'm not going to lie. We got sacked once or twice. And, you know, it was a 10-play drive. I don't know. This is a, you know, this isn't the easiest offensive Madden. De defense definitely feels like you could definitely get some nice stops, especially with the zone drop feature, the match feature. There's plenty of things in this game to get you a stop. And we're not using, we're even using like two of the, I would say, worst defensive teams in the game. And we're still playing some solid defense, if you ask me. Right here, same thing. Cover three cloud look. We got a cloud on the right side. So, you know, if he goes for that corner out, it may or may not be there. He's going to try to go for a bomb. There's just nothing there. See the sheds going crazy. Four-man rush is really good in this year's Madden. Right here, running a little bit of match. And I really don't know what's about to get matched onto. He's going to motion, so it may affect a lot of the, the play. But just a crazy nice bag right there. Um, and we are getting pressure sending three. I mean, I'm loving the, the sheds in this year's Madden. We're going to rock some 30s and 10s. A little cover two action if we are able to get there. All right, we are able to get there. A little cover two action. And I don't know if we got the playoff. And that was a 30, man. That was a 30. I'm not too happy about that. I definitely thought he should have played that in a 30. But, you know, I didn't get my play set up in time. That's on me. Can't complain. Right there, great dot. He hits me with digs. And he jurdles, doesn't fumble. Not asking for a fumble right there. Yeah, let me switch it up, man. He's, he's definitely torching this cover two. Uh, I'm going to stick to this cover three cloud in this um, match type of look. So right here, he was he may have had the seam open for a second. Thankfully, he didn't hit it. And oh my goodness, he makes a wild read. I thought for sure I'd be there. I just was not. Man, I'm not going to lie. I was trying to click onto the cornerback in the right flat, and it just would not let me, man. It would just not let me. He's in weak pro, so we're definitely going to have to start playing the run a little better. We're in this 3 through 5 It's now called Cub, and great play right there to Diggs. Um, I was using the Bills in practice run, and Diggs was just not getting open for me. He's absolutely torching us now, though. Not too happy about that defensive drive. I, I think we were on like a third and long and just gave up a streak. It's all good. It happens. You know, those seam streaks are so viable, so potent in trips. Right here, we, he's kicked us to hard. He kicked it to Hardman. So we, we let's try to make something happen. Okay. You know, I, I had potential running room, but, you know, I'll take it. Right here, I have the corner route open again, but, like, it's just, like, I can't block my tight end. I can't rush outside. This dude, Vaughn Miller, is going crazy right now. Right there, we have the corner route open. Mahomes release once more. It's just like, it's not that good. It's not that good when you're getting heavily blitzed and heavy heavy pressure in your face. I really want to hit Hardman on the streak, but it's just, it, I don't think it's open. We're going to try to hit this seam streak right here, see if we could get it. And great play right there. We don't get the first. I'm going to go no huddle right here just because I don't have any time. We're going to flip this play. We're going to block Ronald Jones. Kelsey on a flat. I mean, this isn't the best play because I'm running out of time. But even if we could get a field goal right here, it'd be nice. He's going to send the pressure. And we are going to have a nice read to Josh Gordon. Could he get into the end zone? We're going to have to run towards the out-of-bounds mark just to be safe. And I believe he ran. I don't even know what that was. But everything was open, man. Everything was open. We got to be safe right here. We can't get sacked. We will take our three gladly. And I'll be honest. I'm looking for a high ball to Travis Kelsey right here, guys. Either him or Juju on the other side. Hopefully we get one or the other. And we're going to throw it away. We're going to throw it away. We had that flat, but I just don't want to get sacked right here. Don't want to get a bad animation. 
I, I kind of want to run that play back, man. I want to run that play back. I know high balls are very good in this year's Madden. I just, I just want to hit a high ball real quick. I have like potentially two plays, honestly. He's moving down his guy. Very good. Uh, uh, very, very smart. Very smart by him. We are probably going to, I don't know. I really don't know what the play call is right here, guys. We'll just call hike again and see what we got. Um, and is that a dot? Oh, that was a beautiful dot, but we just couldn't get our feet in bounds. Um, I think we're going to settle for three, guys. I, I definitely should probably go for this, but I, don't, I just don't have the right and proper play calling right now. Had I had, you know, McCole Hardman in the slot, MVS in the slot, that may have been a touchdown on that corner route, fourth down, but it's all good. We're going into half with the lead. At this point, just keep scoring and we'll be good. We already, we're already got one, you know, pick six in this game. But like I was saying, man, QB releases everything in this Madden with how the pressures are, with how the sheds are. Um, QB releases everything. So, you know, you really have to base your team, whether it be your Mutt team, whether it be your favorite Regs team that you want to run money games with this year. You have to base that around QB release. You know, right now, like I'll, I'll be, I'll keep it a bug. It's not, it's not looking good. For, like it's not looking, you know, smooth for me. I'm definitely audibling around, and you know, kind of, it's a rough living on offense right now. And you could say the same for him as well. I mean, his last two drives have been nice, but at this point, you know, it's, it's not, it's a beta, I guess you could say. I mean, it's, it's like, you know, I'm running random stuff. I'm just trying to show you guys Madden 23 at its best, and I'm liking this game. I'm having fun, man. It's, it's definitely challenging. But, you know, it's none of that, you know, onside, at, at least right now, it's none of the onside and, you know, um, the clock and all that type of stuff. That definitely got old, in my opinion. I don't know if you guys if you guys agree with me on that, but that definitely got old for me. So definitely glad to be playing a new Madden. And we throw a book. I'm not going to lie, guys. That looked so open to me. I got completely baited on that. Um, I wish I could clip that and show you guys, but rewind that, man. I thought I had a wide open player. And I don't know what it was. He just went psycho. Uh, he went psychic right there. And he made a great play. He swatted it down. I should have had MVS right there. I had Juju instead. Um, I got to definitely make a substitution coming in soon. But it's cool, man. It's cool. Like, we're still in it. This is a really good game that you guys are watching right now. But li like and comment if you would have thrown that as well, man. Now, like I said, rewind if you didn't see. That was insane, in my opinion. I definitely thought for sure, like, that was a wide open player, man. I thought he messed up his, his uh, flats or something. Right here, running a little bit of match and, you know, taking a risk. If he has, like, streaks or something down the field, if he has a beater, he's going to have a touchdown. I'm not, you know, re-putting my guy. Okay, I'll do it now since he motioned him. Motion usually messes up the match a little bit. And let's see what we got right here. He's going to call a pretty good play. Uh, makes a late read. If he would have thrown that a little bit earlier, it would have been a dot. Um, I guess we'll try the 25s and 10s right here again. Every time I've ran these, it hasn't really worked, in my opinion. But we'll try here. We'll try it here, guys. Okay, he's going to a... Nice look. He actually had a touchdown um, up the seam. Whew. And he may have been throwing something else as well. I wasn't really paying attention, but thankfully he didn't, you know, dot us up right there. I would have been sick. All right, guys. I think this is now the time to take the risk and send the pressure. We're going to send the heat. And we get a under pressure. Wow. That's one of the worst under pressures I've seen. It was a wide open player. I thought my guy would match. Bad user too. Bad, very bad user. We sent the pressure, but... It's looking like you're going to need fearless in this year's Madden, guys. Like, that was a really bad under pressure. Like, that was that should have been a touchdown, a walk-in touchdown. And it's looking like you're going to need fearless, man. I'm not going to lie. I don't know what play I just called, but I thought I was in a different play. I was. I definitely thought I was in a different play. I thought I was in the Z spawn and go look. We almost had a dot. I did not want to try Tredavious White in that right flat. I definitely thought he was going to make a crazy play as he, he already made one, you know, he already made one crazy play. I thought he would have made another right here. We're going to dump it down to the flat, hopefully make a move. We'll take our yards, you know, we'll take our six yards. All right. We got MVS in the game now. Finally, man, hopefully we could cook up and I'm thinking I'm realizing something. I don't, I don't know if they, they just purposely did this. Okay. There it is. I was looking for the wrong play, man. I was looking for deep out this whole time. Guys, my recording just went out. Sorry for that. I mean, um, I guess it makes sense. I've been recording a lot of content and yeah, I mean, that's the only thing I could say in this time is that I was just recording a lot of content. So forgive me on that, that, uh, my camera went out or whatever it may be. We're trying to cook up right here and that's a great dot to McColl Hardman. Can we get out of there? And I think if I don't, if I have anyone else besides McColl Hardman right there, that's a bag. I tested his really, really good player. I believe that was Micah Hyde again with those abilities. And I don't get it under pressure right there, which is crazy to me. 
he got it under pressure and I didn't get it under pressure. We will gladly take that, of course. No one likes dealing with the under pressures. I don't, I don't know, man. We're making a tough living, but we're, we're moving the ball somehow, some way. Right here, motion blocking and bag, cage, nothing. And you guys got to remember, I'm very used to Madden 22 and you, the fact that you could throw anything. Um, I still had to get used to. I'm sure there's things I could throw in this Madden that I'm just not used to yet. It's right here. We were trying to get that corner route to the right sideline. It was a dot, but this dude, my home, just can't get the ball out. All right, so right here, I'm trying to get to the edge, the left edge, and try to cook up a dot. Hopefully, he motion blocks right here, and it's perfect. It's looking golden. We got to play. I don't know who that was. Shaq Lawson went crazy. I thought that was it. I mean, you've seen it, guys. You guys saw it. We had a touchdown. I tried to escape, and... My, I don't know. We're just, we're not blocking at well at all right now. Not well at all. I had him too. Mahomes, I don't think he would have made the throw. It was a tough throw, but he ha he is really good on the run, man. You guys know this by now. He is insane on the run. Right here, just going to go with a little bit of a bunch trail. Pray something gets blocked. Pray, pray something gets open. And I had him. You guys seen I was throwing it to him, but we stepped up too far into the pocket, man. We had the bomb, man. We had McCole Hardman running deep. Um, he was going to be our bailout for this game and not saying we lost, but it's, you know, it's, it's still a second tough game. It's a very tough game. We are both, I would say I'm more caged than him right now. He has shown me some, you know, right there that may have been a touchdown. That may have been a pick. I don't know how the bombs work in this game, but like I was saying, we both been just kind of struggleville man on offense. He's running a really good defense. My nickel normal, you know, I'm making good adjustments, I'd say, but it's nothing even close and remote to that uh that offense that he's running that offense that he or defense that he's running is insane two four five odd we are gonna try to send the heat right here okay it's gonna be fourth quarter so hopefully you could lock up right here all right we're gonna go for the match look again and hopefully we could uh you know this time scream at him and not give up an open read because last time what we did was terrible we gave him the open player thankfully he overthrew it he's in wide trips now interesting play call and oh my goodness this son is insane um this is a bit very <laughs> This is tough, man. We should have put in a dump, but it's not that serious at this point. We were trying to send the dogs, trying to get off the field, trying to win this game. Could we get a little bit of pressure, man? And not the best user. Um, yeah, I could have used that, but that's Ladarius need. I thought for sure he'd bag that up. It's all good. Fourth and eight right here for the game. Big fourth and eight right here, guys. I'm liking this look on defense right now, man. I am going to do send three look right here. We have a 25 on the right, so any type of like five... Or any type of like underneath route is definitely going to cook us up right there. I should have maybe put him in a purple right there, but it's good. This is solid defense. And oh, I thought I was going to hit stick him and make him drop it. He ends up, he ends up hanging on to a good dot right there. Ah, I'm, I'm definitely like, I got to make a better adjustment on that. I got to hit stick that or something. Uh, just a good dot, you know, can't complain about that. And I'd send the heat, but I have not been able to scream whatsoever at one time at all. He's going to hit us up the seam. Great high ball. Um, and yeah, as soon as he goes in this doubles type of look, I'm having some issues guarding everything. That was just a sleepy user. He's going for two again. Let's see what he what he shows us right here. Nothing really open. Can we pick it off and run it back? We swat it down. It's cool. You know, touchdown takes the lead. We got to score, man. We got to score. It's been tough scoring the ball. McCall Hardman, let's, let's, let's get jiggy one time, man. Let's get jiggy one time. I have I have lanes. I have lanes. That's all I'm asking for, man. I just got to make it work next time. We're definitely feeling the pressure now, man. Um, we have this momentum on right now. Good read to the flats. I should have been hitting the flats this whole game. I've just not been looking that way. And there's really no system on my offense right now. I'm just calling money plays and hoping they work. Don't we all do that, right? Right here, we are going to have... <sighs> Bro, get the ball out, Mahomes. I had the crosser wide open, and he just can't hit the read that I need him to make it. The ball, like, I was just trying to hit that ball out, and he just was not able to do so. I'm honestly going to run base right here. You know, hate me for this play call. I'm going to run base. We end up getting the first. Spin to the right. Edwards Hilaire breaks the tackle. And I don't want to get too sweaty, bro. Like, I'm just, you know, we're just having fun. But I needed to get that first, man. I was not comfortable whatsoever versus 245 odd. I mean, this, this, it's screaming, man. You guys see it firsthand that it screams every play. Right here, you know, freestyle and a route combo. I really just want to hit McCole Hardman deep. All right, Zig route, we'll take that. He's been giving it to us all game. I'm going to go on conservative right here, guys. I don't, I don't want to fumble. 
All right, I'm starting to see the playbook better now. Hopefully, we could uh, cook up a play right here. I'm really liking this play. I messed it up real one time, but you know we're, we'll readjust it. I'm gonna motion block right here. Try to roll out to the right. Hopefully, hit this corner route. That's the main goal. Motion block is in set. He could have user that. Not the best user by him. Uh, but did did you, did you guys see what I just saw? This dude, Vaughn Miller, absolutely just went crazy on that man. I mean, that was actually insane what he just did. And he's on that same side again. So, hey, we're going to try to motion block. We messed it up this time, but we actually got time. Boom. Great job. We're getting time finally. Could we get to the edge? And no. I'm not going to clock this. It's not that serious, but I'm definitely going to start running the ball right here just for this whole fact that it's easy. And, you know, he's not in the best run, D. Right here, we're going to hit this RPO bubble. Hopefully, he does not, you know, shed or, you know, go crazy and pick it off. And he picked it off. I literally called it. I don't know if that was a run commit or not. But he is going to crib this, and that's going to be game. I literally, literally self-prophesized that. I should have, I don't know. I should have just ran the ball. But to be fair, I had numbers. I did not think he'd go crazy and pick that off. I don't know. Maybe bubbles are dead this year, guys. He's going to hit us with a fake. And I mean, bruh, this is not the pattern to do fakes. You just can't get the ball out at all. McCole Hardman is due for one man. I mean, if we need it, it's now. And we get absolutely freaking pummeled. Things that it looks like you're going to need in this year's Madden. Edge protector, good QB with a release. That's all I really needed in this game is an edge protector, a little bit of pass protection, and a good QB with a release. We're going to run this play back. This play actually was starting to work. See if Von Miller goes crazy again, and he does. And I mean, I have people open. You guys see it, but I just can't do anything because of Von Miller. And let me find out. I should have just been throwing the high balls to Travis Kelsey all game because this is this has been tough. This has been tough to throw with uh, Mahomes. We're gonna just try to just dink it down, dink it down. I want to spin, but I'm on conservative. Got to go no huddle. Try to get to the out of bounds mark. Dang, that that really hurt me, man. Cause like I was actually in a good spot. I want to say to win the game, but to you know potentially take the lead and play a little bit of defense. That's what we all want at the end of the day. And I actually had another touchdown, man. I'm just getting absolutely screamed at in this, this game. And obviously, I'm not a trips player. We're going to try to go deep right here. And he manned it up this time. Good stuff by him. And, you know, it's looking like I'm going to have to get in the lab. I'm going to have to get in the lab and, you know, check out these pass protections and all that type of stuff. Because it looks like play action is pretty good. And, of course, I say that, and Fawn Miller is going crazy again, man. Let's see if our ID will do it this time. I mean, this, at this point in the game, the game is entirely cooked. Um, you know, that was actually not bad. Throw right at him, though. We had some other players open. Guys, we're going to end up getting flooded in this game. And, man, K-Mac is tough, man. That 2-4-5 odd is one of the meta defenses in this year's Madden. If you guys did enjoy this gameplay... Leave a like. We'll be back with some more. Trust me. I mean, I, I'm not too mad about the way I played. I was playing really good in the beginning. And then after some time, I just, I don't know. I was just bagged, man. I was just bagged. But, I mean, this isn't my type of playbook. I don't run trips. I do run bunch. But, you know, this bunch is not that good, in my opinion. Um, I have some good stuff in store, man. I can't wait to run it and can't wait to show it. Hopefully, soon for you guys. And I'm probably just going to run the ball right here. We tried to get Makahola Hardman deep a couple times. Uh and it just wasn't working. I don't know what was going on. If the I had one specific play. Like, I'm still remembering that play. It was kind of insane. Uh, see right here, we actually hit a nice read. But it's all good. I'm not even going to call the timeout. GG's in the chat to K-Mac. This was the first play. And, of course, they're not going to show it from the beginning. But, man, I, like, this probably was a run commit, right? That's what I'm thinking. I I, I probably, like, I should have not, not thrown it. That was on me, guys. Uh, but the other play I'm talking about was right out of half. This play was insane, in my opinion. Um, and let's see. Let's see what I saw. So, in my opinion, I see a wide open Juju Smith running down the sidelines. Wide open. And, and you know you trips. I, I don't know if this was like because it was a fade I ran. But this is wide open, man. I got to make this throw. I'm throwing it right away. Look, at, like, I'm throwing it right away. And he just cuts it off. I should have had someone faster there. I don't know. I'm learning the game still. It's all good. I had other people open. But that was the right read in that play. Maybe you just can't throw that this year. So till next time, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. GG's in the chat once more, and I'll catch you guys.